Hello there. It's your boy, Tasty Cake. Okay. Yeah, you can see it did a little bit of cleaning. And it has to clean every two weeks. You know, I gotta change things. But for now, this is how it's gonna be. Next week I do some cleaning somewhere else. But for now, we'll see. That right now, it's time for rest reviews. <laughs> And on Res Reviews, you know, mainly I just talk about um, snacks. And this time we're going to talk about Pearson's Bun Vanilla. With a real, with a real milk chocolate, roasted peanuts, and vanilla nougat. Made in the USA since 19... Oh, guess 1947, people. Mm-hmm. It actually expired at the beginning of the month, but you know, I did cleaning, so. Uh, there's the snacks right there. Snacks are there. Oh, snacks are there. Going in two places for snacks. Ba -ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. Snacks. Snacks. My snacks. So they're off the floor. Kill some bugs, too. There's another one there, too. But, you know, it's it's selling a little bit higher, so once I get the stuff done, then I'll get more snacks. But for now, this one expired at the beginning of the month, and so I eat it now. It also comes with maple, but that'll be the second video. That expired a couple days ago. So for this one, the ingredients are milk chocolate. Sugar, cocoa, butter, milk, chocolate liqueur, non-fat dry milk, Ready? soy lectin added as an emulsifier, vanilla, that's the milk chocolate, has sugar, peanuts, corn, syrup, salt, modified soy protein, invertus. Natural and artificial vanilla flavor. Cream of tartar. Tartar sauce? Tartar sauce. Uh, and tree nuts. Pecan flour. Almond flour. Contains milk, peanuts, soy, and tree nuts. Pecan and almond. Manufactured in a facility that processes eggs and wheat. Manufactured by Pearson's St. Paul, Minnesota, 55116. Pearsonscandy.com contains bioengineered food ingredients. So even back in 1947, they have bioengineered food ingredients? I don't doubt it. Welcome to USA. But Pearsons, making everyday moments a little bit sweeter since 1909. But uh, the bun vanilla has been made since 1947. We should have Pearson stuff since 1909. And then let's get to nutritional facts. One serving per container serves serving size one bar fifty grams. Calories per serving two hundred forty. Um, amount serving of total fats eleven grams at fourteen percent. Saturated fats five grams at twenty five percent. That's the daily value right there. Trans fat zero grams. Cholesterol five milligrams at two percent. Sodium eighty five milligrams at the daily value of four percent. Total carbs are 32 grams, a daily value of 12%, dietary fiber 1 gram, 4%. Total sugars 28 grams, include 26 added sugars, makes it 52%. You know, it wasn't like that back in the day. People didn't have need have the need for so much sugar. Now it's check your blood sugar and check it often. Protein 3 grams with vitamin D, 0%. Calcium 44 milligrams, 4%. No iron. Potassium, 133 milligrams at 2%. The percent daily value tells you how much an ingredient is ingredient in a serving of food contributes to a daily diet. But not in America. 2,000 calories a day is used for general nutritional advice. In general. So, more or less, you're screwed no matter what you do.
Let me open this bad boy up here. And, wow. It's a big old nugget of stuff. You know. Compared to what it was a Google cluster. Yeah. But this was a Pearson's. And I bought it because it was fresh. And it's also gluten free. It's gluten free. 1.75 ounces at 50 grams. Let's see. Let's take a bite of this bad boy. I should have grabbed a glass of milk. Mm -hmm. I should have grabbed a glass of milk. Pardon me, I'm going to get some milk. <sighs> yeah, it was Thursday. I drank half a glass of milk. It does about good. Not because it was dry or anything. Or it's been a while. Big old chunk of marshmallow in there and the nuts and chocolate, you know. Mm. I don't think I can eat the second one anytime soon. Well, a few days because it expires. It's expired. All for views, huh? Mm. Too much light. Too much stuff. Mm. That's about right. Whew. Maybe it was a 52% sugar. You know, I don't drink... Well, I drink soda, but it has ice. It's iced. Not iced down, you know, but mm -hmm. on a keyboard. Mm. I don't want to get another glass of milk. Hmm. I don't even think we sell this anymore. <laughs> I think it was a one-time deal. Maybe in a Google, Google, well, I can't even say it. Worcestershire. I can say Worcestershire. I can say Worcestershire sauce, but I can't say Goo Goo Cluster. Where my glasses are? Holy dirty. Brain works, you suck. Next time I go to America Best. <clears throat> America's Best for your glasses. Can't even wear my... Anyway, sorry. Rip, ramble on and on. So if you're into Google clusters, you know, that's pretty much the same. Like when you go to a tourist trap. I mean, yeah, tourist trap. And look for them souvenirs and stuff. They'll have Goo Goo Clusters. Not, I haven't never seen Pearson's before. So, okay, try it. You used to be sold Dollar Tree. I mean, back in the day. 50 cent kind of day, you know. So if you're into the big old bunch of stuff, you know. The other one's maple. I'll try it next week. But when you get older, it's kind of like, mm, not too sweet. I remember back in the day, I used to eat that stuff. The wow, Google Clusters, yay! So, same thing. But, you know, time marches on. Like uh, the old the chunky bars. The raisins in it. Can't find it anywhere, but maybe like Cracker Barrel. 
It costs too much, that's why I'm not going to buy it. But those are good days. So if you like the, you know, milk, peanuts, soy, and tree nuts, pecan, pecan, and almonds, good for you. Try it. It's, it's not the same as it was because nothing's the same. You can have a Butterfinger now, it's like, I don't like it. Oh my, I do not like Butterfinger now. Like the old one. Mm. Is, that, is it interesting? The sugar really got me. Like 52%. And I don't feel like throwing away the old one. The other one. Because it's maple flavor. I mean, I like this stuff back in the day, but... If you like it, you know, let's see if you can find Look for Pearson's Bun Vanilla or Google Clusters. It's not something you want to do all the time. Unless you want to have diabetes, you know. Of course, you can't by drinking a freaking Coca-Cola, for God's sake. I mean, 100, that's three times, Coke has three times the amount of sugar. Fake sugar. Now, it doesn't say high fructose corn syrup. But it does say corn syrup. That's the same difference. It's just not high in fructose. So, let's see, you can't go back. You can't relive a lot of things. Sometimes you can't go back and take the words away that takes off your internet girlfriend who is really. Anyway. So, please like, subscribe. Please like, subscribe, share, comment. On the, thank you. You can catch me on Twitch under Tasty Cake. Same thing. I don't have an exclamation point. I'm just type in Taste Tea Cake. And if you don't know how to spell it, then look on the page. It's on my page here. I have the links to. Check out taste the cake on the socials on my facebook page i swear i'm going to update it if uh you know me i'm on instagram you know where to find me because do i no i don't use my real name none of the socials have my real name except for facebook so if you know me you can please ask to add me on facebook Facebook fan pages, Taste the Cake on the socials. Twitch is Taste the Cake. On here is Taste the Cake. Or YouTube.com slash at. That's a bull. Reverend Amagon to spread the word. I will be on Twitch Sunday nights for a little while. Sunday, uh, Sunday afternoon. Still pondering the time. And Wednesday afternoon. Not the same time. About 3 o'clock or so. Just chatting. Nothing we're going to talk about. Just, you know, want to get live. And I could be live on YouTube, but I'm trying to spread it out. As my former internet girlfriend told me to. Uh, she's a girl. She, she was my friend. So that considered a girlfriend. But now we go on living his separate lives. So thank you and and um, as always, how about some cake? Mm, tasty cake. <laughs>